Stefano and Domenico spoke about the girls looking really pure and angelic. And to create this look, we use quite a few products, but it, they're very easy and very simple to apply. With Dolce Gabbana Creamy Foundation, sometimes I like to apply the whole thing with my fingers, and then I finish with a brush. I took a nude pencil and I crayoned in on the lids and inside the eyes. I took the desert quad and I took the lightest color and added just to give the lids a real finish so that you really see the eyes pop. Because of all the fantastic brocades, the richness in the collection, we took a beautiful gold from the gold quad and literally just added it to the center of the lids here and also to the inner corners of the eyes. And then I shape the eyes using actually the tan blusher and just on the sockets and under the eyes, I just created a beautiful, very nude kind of toned eye. This just uh, gives, makes the eyes look very serene but very beautiful at the same time. We took the Delight blush and just added with the Fab Dolce Gabbana blusher brushes a little blush to the cheek area, just to give you that innocence and that brightness and that beauty to the face. One other step is the mascara, which we all adore, Secret Eyes, to give beautiful weight to the lashes. Now the color we're using today is brown, because obviously we spoke about this softness to the whole of the face and to the eye area. And then on the lips, my two favorite colors, mandorla and petal mixed together to give that very, very beautiful natural pink lip. For the nails, we used the fabulous new tone just to make the nails perfect. We didn't want to do just a simple shine. We used a new tone to go with this beautiful, bright Sicilian Baroque feel. So this is a look. This is the finished look for Dolce Gabbana.